Where to? Wherever Templar affairs lead us. Liam, it's not like you to set out without a plan. A plan or no plan. We choose our own battlefield. And hey, we're not most at ease when we're at sea. Right you are. Let's set sail. We only have one lead, Shane. Let's hope it brings us closer to the artifacts. Sir Achilles tasked you with this mission. No. Find what was stolen from that in our shape. We have to recover the precursor box of manuscript. This is your mission. But what's yours? Watch your arse. Achilles doesn't really trust me, does he? Give it time, Shay. Do this for him. For us. You'll do much more than earn his trust. Liam, do you know what Achilles writes about? I see him in his office all the time, bent over his papers. He keeps records and accounts. Studies what little is known about the pieces of Eden. And of course, he corresponds with assassins on other continents. Liam, you can be a right horse's arse when it comes to assuming everyone knows the same as you. I cannot help if Achilles wants me to be familiar with our counterparts in Europe and elsewhere. Said like his favorite son. Connor's his favorite and only son. Then Achilles is heir. Connor may inherit the house, but you'll be mentor. We'll see. Whatever you say, Prince Regent of the Assassins. You call me that again, I'll throw you in the ocean.
the topsails and gallant. the royals and tops. Trim off the wind. All down. All down. Let go anchor. Trust me, you will sell those lobster by the tongue in France. The cabbage farmers return. About time. We have a lead on that curious manuscript. I'll be surprised if you can read it. No one can read it, imbecile. This is why the Templar are taking so long with it. But one of our allies has caught a glimpse of their work. A pirate? A spy who worked with the pirate. We set sail for Anticosti. That should prove a good test for this floating cesspit you call a ship. How trustworthy are the pirates? I consider them brothers. When the time comes, they will end aid and help us fight the Templars. If only the roast beef would realize the Templars were pulling their strings. Are the Templars truly in control in the colonies? Not quite, but their influence reaches far and wide. And what about the spy we're meeting? You need not worry about Le Chasseur. He is loyal to the Brotherhood. As it happens, he also has friends in both the French and English fleets. And he knows more about what goes on in his parts than you can ever hope to learn. So, Liam, what could you tell me about Adewale? You obviously admire the man. I, I had the honor of working with him once. I've never known anyone who'd done so much for our cause. It's much more than that. Adewale was already a liaison before joining the Brotherhood. He was a pirate, a scourge of the West Indies, rubbing elbows with the likes of Blackbeard, Woods Rogers, and Calico Jack Rackham. Calico who? Oh, read a book, will you? About 20 years ago, Adewale intercepted a Templar convoy and stole a mysterious package. He traveled to port au prince and entrusted it to a woman he believed was loyal to our cause. There, Captain. An English vessel. And she looks to be in trouble. That's fine indeed. Perhaps we should aid her journey to the bottom of the sea. I say this... Parts. Be careful. A few shots should be enough to cripple her. Too much damage and she'll go down with all souls and all spoils. We can board and loot her before the crew knows what hit them. Let's border! Blue the foreman! Show right them right. what's for, Captain! Come on, man! The spires are ours! For the Morrigan!
At the sea between here and Anticosti is rough, Captain. We should strengthen the market before going any further. There's a harbour master stationed nearby. We can spend our new wealth on improvements. I didn't realize there was a brotherhood in Haiti. Yes. Francois McCandle is their mentor. He gathers many of his assassins from the maroons. Those are escaped slaves and their children, right? They are. A shame, though. They escaped terrible conditions only to be killed in that earth. But Haiti's a French colony now. Aye, oh, it is. Look! And here, the assassins are helping King Louis. But in Haiti, the French own the slaves who are set free by the assassins. Our struggle is beyond political borders, Shay. Anticosti shouldn't be far. Keep us on course, Captain. Is this the place? I see nothing but fishermen and their gear. Aye, per se and fishing go hand in hand, but it will serve our purposes well enough. The French fish these waters first, but King George is laying claim to more every year. The locals are caught in the middle. He's off the wind! Haul it all sail! What's on your mind, Captain? My thanks for your trust, Captain. Captain, how's the wheel? We should resume course to Anticosti, Captain. Indeed. The chasseur is waiting for us. The sea between here and Anticosti is rough, Captain. The Morrigan seems sturdy enough for the challenge. Ships ahoy! More fishermen from Perse. Enemy ships! They're sinking the fishing boats! You must believe those fishermen strayed into their waters. And these cowards must pay! And would you look at that? We're standing right in our way to Anticosti. What say you? We sink every last one of them. For once, I find myself agreeing with you, Shay. Stranger things have happened. Fire! 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 Fire!
Guys, a man out on the ocean is as free as a man can be. What do you say, Liam? Be liberated until we pry them off. Seems to me we should just talk to them like that instead of skulking around. Would you smile? They're boot on your neck? Of course not. The murderous bastards want to control the world and everyone in it. Never forget. We have nothing in common with that, of course. There it is. Anticusty. The chasseur should be there. And with any luck, he will know where to find that manuscript. Ship here, Captain. We've arrived at Anticosti Island. Look at this. I borrowed these plans from a Royal Navy ship of the line. They are like nothing I have ever seen. Good. We could use some more powerful weapons. Le Chasseur, allow me to present our associate, Shea Cormac. Gentlemen, I have news. On this same ship, I spied the manuscript you seek. It was written in an exotic language I did not recognize and was full of drawings. Plants and animals out of an opium dream. Where there no charts, no, no, no maps. No, there may have been some kind of code, but neither I nor the roast beefs could get. Where is the manuscript now? The man who brought it said a man named Washington sent him. I know that name. He's an important Templar, isn't he? He is. Lawrence Washington has great ambitions that Templars have helped fulfill. Shay, it's your turn to find him. You, sir, have our thanks. 